Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here, and this is a video response to Casey's question, and she was asking about my Ashley Jaro sleeper sofa. Now, I apologize the mess right now. I'm doing some uh, construction projects, and I didn't want to get all my suits and stuff all all goobered up, so it, it's kind of a mess. But what I want to show you is the size. So I took the time here. I got my tape measure, and I did this before I grabbed my phone, and you're looking from the end of the chaise here to the back of the sofa, you're looking at approximately 51 inches. So that's how, you know, how deep it is. So it's about 51 inches uh, deep. And then as far as the width, um, let's see, let's measure that. I'm going to, I'm going to sit this phone down and we're going to get you a good, good estimation here. How about that? Let's see if I can put this down on my, on my bike. Let's see. There we go. Let's see if I can prop it up with something. Sorry, my other camera, I'm, I'm using it for something else and I don't have it out right now. And I'm just kind of improvising with this, whoa, with this handheld phone. Ah, uh, let's see. This will work. Let's do this. There we go. So now we're going to measure from side to side. So I said the depth of the Ashley Jarro sofa that I have, Chase sleeper sofa. Again, from the from the back, the back of the sofa to the front of this little Chase piece is about 51 inches. Now, as far as how wide this is, I'm gonna measure that. So the width is approximately, and I say approximately, cause I'm just kind of resting this on the, uh, on the thing there. Uh, I locked it in. So here's what we got right here. So the width of it, and again, this is my Ashley Jar Row sofa. As you said, there's other sizes too. Uh, the width is approximately, let's see, what was that? About seven feet? Oh, there it is, yeah. It was approximately seven feet. So, you know, from that end to the other end, from, from armrest over here to armrest over there is about seven feet. And again, I apologize for the mess. I just, I wanted to get, whoa, I wanted to give you a quick, uh, hopefully quick response to your question. Appreciate your question. It is worth mentioning. I love this thing. Uh, this Ashley Jar Row, because see, I've got a tight space. You know, I've got, this is my YouTube studio. So I got my, Ashley Jar Row, and then I got my rowing machine, and then I've got my exercise bike, and it's just, it's a tight space, but, you know, if you're looking at, you know, I will say, and you, you've already watched my other video, this is a good size. I mean, it's, it's big enough. I mean, granted, when I stretch out, because I'm six foot two, my feet hang off the bottom, but I actually like that, because if I had dirty socks or dirty shoes, which I disallow shoes in this office, uh, but if I did, my feet are just hanging off and they're not getting on the sofa. And I don't know, I can tell you when I sleep on this, and again, you know, that, that piece pops out like I showed in the other video. But when I sleep on this, I've got plenty of room. I'm guessing I may have the smaller version of the two. If you looked at another one, I and I may be wrong, but I don't think this is a queen. But I guess if you if you pop these cushions out... See, there's there's the uh, sofa underneath. So if you want to make it a little bit wider, you could take the cushions off the back and you, you could probably, yeah, you could sleep two people if you took the cushions off the back. So yeah, it is, it is, a, it is a pretty good, uh, pretty good width. When I, when I sleep up here, sometimes I just sleep on, uh, I, I keep the cushions there and I just sleep here and I've got plenty of room. So, uh, Casey, I hope this answered your question. Again, sorry for the sloppy mess, but it is what it is, and I just wanted to post a response ASAP. Thanks for your viewership, and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you have any more questions about the Ashley Jar Row, uh, just comment below, and I'll try my best to answer. Y'all have a good day.